We are going to download and install Python and also we are going to write and run a simple code in Python. So first of all, you should go to python.org. Then here you should click on downloads, click on this. And now in this page, you should scroll down. And here you can see that the Python versions has been sorted according to the release date. So we want Python 3.11.4, so I click on this. And in this page, I should scroll down. Here you can see here are the files. So because I'm on Windows and I have a 64-bit Windows, so I click on this in order to download the installation file. So here we can see this is the downloaded file, so I right-click on it and click on Run as Administrator. So in this step, it is very important to check this one, at python.exe to path, so I click on this. And also I want to customize the installation, so I click on this. And once again, I press next. And in this step, this install location is very important because there is going to be a file here called interpreter, Python interpreter, which you need it later. For example, if you want to install other IDEs, such as, for example, PyCharm, you need to know the location of this install location. You need to know the location of that interpreter. So this install location is very important. So suppose that I want to install Python here. So in order to do so, I click on this and I copy this path. That's it. I go to uh, Python install and here I paste this location and I press install. And I should wait for the installation. And as you can see, it's creating some files and folders in this install location. So as you can see, the setup was successful. So I press close. And here in this install location, you can see we have a file called python.exe, which is the Python interpreter. If you don't see these extensions, you should go to view and check this one, file name extensions. If you check this one, you can see these extensions. So this python.exe is basically the interpreter of Python, which is an important file. And you need to know the install location of Python because of this file. So now I press Windows key on my keyboard and you can see these files have been recently added. And you can see one of them is IDLE. And if you don't see these files, you can search for it. You can search for IDLE. And as you can see, we have, we have installed Python 3.11. So I should click on this. So now let's create and run a simple Python file. So in order to do so, I click on File, New File. And here I can start coding. So for example, suppose that I want to draw a star. So in order to do so, this is the code which I want to use. So this is the code for drawing a star. That's it. So first of all, I should save this file. So I click on file and save. And suppose that I want to save it in this folder. And let's name it code 01. That's it. And I press save. So you can see it is code 01.py. .py is the extensions of Python files. And now in order to run this, I click on run and run module so python starts running the code and drawing a star and let's close the output so the running process has been finished and if i go to that folder you can see here is our file and if you could do me a favor and like the video i would really appreciate it because it helps the video to reach more people